so I noticed the first time of my deload this time that during my squats I went like super uh, stiff on one side of my leg and I think it's a little ankle immobility so I'm gonna do some stretching and um, it always helps a little bit but I really have to improve this and I'm gonna do crazy shit about it now because I'm only one week out but um, I think it will be a good thing to <laughs> see uh, and I want to show you guys what stretching only alone does before your um, before your training because as you can see it's my left leg which is really stiffer at the ankle and after the routine I'll do now you can see it gets a little bit better Okay, so that's still definitely far from perfect, uh, but I think it's better and I should just put this in my squat routine. Um, so just going up now to 50%, which will be 60 kilograms, and I'm gonna do 3 by 4 just take it easy, maybe do some deadlifts later, or I'll see if, uh, I think I'm, I'm not even sure if I'm gonna do deadlifts, I wanna do, um, today's Monday, I wanna do training on Wednesday, and then I'll call it a day. And Wednesday will be really like, like 50, 40%, and just two or three sets of two or three reps. Um, so that's it for now, I'm gonna do some squats and go for a night nice ride outside because as you can see it's a lovely beautiful weather outside which should be really enjoyed okay off to squats first I kind of like the weather outside here and the deload it's not that bad neither I think because I did really heavy ones uh, kind of testing uh, this weekend on Saturday I did squats and bench and on Sunday I did deadlifts so having a deload now and light training isn't that bad um, so I just did my first set of squats with 60 kilograms super light of course I'll just finish the, the three sets of four and then I'll do deadlifts after um, that'll be chill, a chill evening for me getting lazy, getting food in because I'm I don't know if I told you yet but I'm uh, entering the 72 class and I'm like 60, uh, 67 kilograms so I got a way comfortable range up there so I don't need to worry at all about food and for a moment I thought about going to the 63 class but that was really just causing too much stress, uh, too much strength loss, it wasn't worth it. I think I'm just best in this class so uh, I just need to qualify, get the 300 kilograms which would be doable, easy and be done with it. Well, until December when the Nationals will be so hopefully I'll attend there.
first day load slash preparing for the uh, national qualifications training. One more to go. It was really easy. The only thing is that it's really, really warm in here. It's really summer in the Netherlands, which is a good thing. So I'm gonna go outside, first grab some food, go to the city, just chill a little bit. And like I said, grab some good food. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And to have a little insight about how I deload and what I do to prepare. I'm not saying this was my ideal prep, as you guys know, because I had a, a week off the day before. I was in um, another country, so that wasn't easy. I couldn't train there. So I did my deload there. I'm gonna peak now. Does it make sense? I don't care. I just need to qualify and I'll go for my best stats in December, even because when Blair didn't work for me and I lost strength and size and everything but I don't care I'm gonna have lots of fun a friend of my own is coming I'm really excited to that and um, so a few more days to go see you guys there